Hello guys, welcome to Simple Tech Solutions. Today I'm working on HP Pavilion 27-R178A all-in-one system. In this video, I'll be showing you the problem I have with this PC and how to fix it. So let's start. So what is the problem? Well, I have three problems with this PC. Number one is when I turn on the PC, the computer screen starts to flicker. As you can see here the screen flickering stays until the computer freezes and then the PC restarts the second problem is that when I'm browsing online the computer responds with the following error message this page is having a problem as you can see it on the screen and the third problem is that we get a blue screen of death with error code memory management this blue screen is a common error when a system has a faulty memory module. So since I have a blue screen, I will be checking the memory module first just to make sure that the memory modules are not faulty. How to test the memory module on this system? So sorry I forgot to record on how to get to the memory testing menu. So if you want to test your memory, Make sure your PC is off. Turn the PC on. Next click the escape key on your keyboard which is located at the top left hand corner. Then press the F2 key. From there choose the memory menu and select the quick test option. As you can see here I'm running a quick memory test. Just to make sure we do not have a faulty memory module. Okay, the test has been completed successfully and we can see that we do have a faulty memory module. So we need to replace this before we perform any other solution. And for those who have a faulty memory as well, I have placed a link in the description below on how to change the memory on this PC. So after replacing the memory, I'll be running the quick memory test again just to make sure that the memory module we have replaced are working fine. Okay, the quick memory test has been completed successfully and everything is working fine. So let's test the system to make sure if it has solved all our error messages.
As you can see the PC has been running for some time and we have not seen any of those three problems. This is due to replacing the faulty memory. So just remember, next time when you get the blue screen with error code memory management, remember to test the RAM first before doing any other thing. As I said, most of the time fixing the RAM would fix so many other problems. So I have successfully solved this issue by replacing the memory. If you find this video useful, give a like or leave a comment. To stay up to date with my latest videos and more tips, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.